Just evaluate the limit x tends to theta x cot theta minus theta cot x divided by x minus theta. We know that most of the limit formula that we have is h tends to 0 h tends to 0. Here but we have x tends to theta. How can I get h tends to 0? Well, let us take let x minus theta equal to h x minus theta b equal to h. Then observe that h a x tends to theta h tends to 0. So, let l equal to this limit then l equal to limit h tends to 0. Okay, we are taking x minus theta equal to h. So, x equal to theta plus h x equal to theta plus h and h is tending to 0 x equal to theta plus h in denominator we simply have x minus theta equal to h. But we do not have any formula any standard formula that we can remember about so far. So, let us write cot in term of cos by sin h is it cot can be written as cos theta by sin theta cot can be written as cos theta by sin theta. Now, of course, if we want to simplify then we have to take LCM. And you have to cross multiply as well theta plus h into cos theta sin theta plus h minus theta into cos theta plus h into sin theta divided by h into sin theta into sin theta plus h. Now, if we have h here and also h here that term we can cancel it out. So, let us break this quantity. So, this equal to limit h tends to 0 theta into cos theta into sin theta plus h plus h into cos theta into sin theta plus h minus theta into cos theta plus h into sin theta whole thing divided by h into sin theta into sin theta plus h. Once again limit h tends to 0 as it is as we said earlier we can cancel h and h. So, that term will write it separately and from this expression if we take theta common you have sin a cos b minus cos a sin b that is sin a minus b. Once again we have sin a cos b minus cos a sin b that is sin a minus b. So, sin theta plus h minus theta. What about other quantity? Well, sin theta this expression we have sin theta plus h minus sin theta denominator we copy as it is. Okay, let us not break it h into cos theta into sin theta plus h plus h into cos theta into sin theta plus h. Yo. So, this limit can be written as limit h tends to 0 
limit h tends to 0, uh, theta that is independent of h, sin h by h because theta gets cancelled here, sin h by h into uh, 1 by sin theta into sin theta plus h. Well, we can compute this quantity. What about other one? h gets cancelled, cos by sin is cot, cot theta, sin theta plus h get cancelled. Oh, just cot theta. Now, here is h, h tends to 0, sin h by h tends to 1. So, you are left out with theta by sin theta. H, h tends to 0, sin theta plus h tends to sin theta plus cot theta. So, that is equal to theta into 1 by sin square is cosec square theta plus cot theta and we are done.